What's up guys, Boombox Studios here. Now, have you ever heard of a poly station? An image should be covering my face right now, so you can't see the face I'm making. Oh, wait, the image went away? I, I, I didn't do that. Anyway, they are, obviously, as you saw, it's called poly station. It's a off-brand fake PlayStation. It's not a game anymore. It doesn't look at PS1. <laughs> I had Wait, a PS1. What? It's just not a game anymore. It's just not a game anymore. <laughs> that happened to be very rare for whatever reason. Now, because I'm a techie, I really want one, obviously. And a couple days ago, I saw one on eBay, and that's the first one listing I've seen in about two years. Yeah, they're rare. And not only was it like just the poly station and it's probably scuffed and you know broken and stuff. Yeah, Sharpie? Oh. oh. No. Basically mint condition in the box. Basically brand new. And obviously that's what this video is. Unboxing and reviewing a poly station three mini Y2K super edition. And without further ado, let's just, let's look at it already. Yeah, I wasn't kidding. Deluxe Y2K version. This is very old. Now, I can't find any research on this exact model um literally i can't find anything about it except on one website there was one image of this box like this and there and that was a link to a video that was on a website that i'm not even going to say because it was so sketchy and i'm never going to go on that website again but yeah that's the only info i can find on it and there is no info in the video either but I have one, and this is going to be the second info on this model ever. Wow, that's crazy. So let's, uh, let's, uh, unbox it. Just one of these tabby boys. You can see here a uh, super, uh, random number in one. <laughs> but the cartridge says four in one. No, of course, they're... That is sold separately. This is built into the console, as every Fami clone is. Oh yeah, did I mention it's a Fami clone? As you can see, there we go. Okay, there is the package. And yeah, yeah, you're probably surprised because of how good condition this is. And how, like, mint this is. Yeah, I was surprised too when I saw this. And you know what? It wasn't a million dollars. It was 30. Obviously, someone doesn't know the value of a poly station. I mean, if I didn't know anything about tech, honestly, I would think nothing about a poly station too. So, I'll give the guy credit. He's very nice, by the way. Good seller. Anyway, I can see where they got the name. Where is it? Does he even say? Yeah, Mini. I can see where they got the name Mini. Um, instead of, uh, well, no, I guess it was just called the PS1. Um, but yeah, it's definitely going off the PS1 Mini, or whatever the heck you call it. Um, you got your reset button here. Also, there you go. Yeah. Very wait, wait, is this a... <laughs> what? Who made is out it, with the inside? Is that for a CD, but then it just has a cartridge insert? Yeah. What? You know what? I haven't seen. Does a CD actually fit in here? Okay. I want to do this test. Oh, yeah. It doesn't have feet on it, by the way. It's just plastic outcuts. They never put feet on these models. Anyway, I wonder if it actually fits a CD. Let me hold... Because... Oh, yeah. This model, by the way... If you're looking for a hinge and an open button, well, this doesn't have an open button and it doesn't have a hinge, so this is not the model for you. Anyway, okay, does a CD fit in here? You know what, I'm surprised. 
a CD does fit in. And of course it closes properly because that's, wow, that's crazy. And turn it on. Okay, let's play our games. No, I say games. I put in an XP disc. Wow, it didn't even spin. Totally broken. Uh, no, Um. anyway, okay. So, here. oh, here's a fun game. Okay, what video output do you think it has? Here's our list. Okay, the, the, the board is on the screen right now. You choose A, B, or C. Okay, finished guessing? Perfect. Of course it's AV. It says Y2K. What else could they put? And yeah, it has RF. Because it's that old that it has AV and RF. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's right. AV and RF. Yeah. This is not new. Also, another thing that gives it away. Well, this doesn't really give it away. I see ones on Alibaba with these. Um because they just don't know what they do. Here is a light gun. If you're interested in light guns, don't get one if you don't have a CRT, because they need cathodes from the CRT to actually aim. Yeah, it'll work on a LCD. I mean, it won't work on an LCD. It'll register the button click. Like, it'll sh black the screen out and just show the sprite for, like, a split second. Because it sees the button get pushed. But it won't do anything. So, yeah, it's still fun to pretend, though, with that. Also, I just want to say, I don't know why, but the company PolyStation has a bad rap for um, exploding when you plug it in. Guys, I'm disappointed. You probably thought we were about to plug it in, and we tried to, but guess what happened? The whole thing blew up. <laughs> it literally shorted. Did it really? Yeah. And especially because this one is obviously very, very old. I was worried about that. But the most weirdest thing happened when I plugged it in. I plugged the power supply. Yes, it's been tested. I have tested it. I played with it already. But still, I plugged it in the wall. Then I plugged it in the poly station. And then, scarily, I pushed the power button and... It actually turned on. That's the most strangest thing that has ever happened in the universe. I was totally ready for this thing to blow up. Like, seriously. I don't know why they have a bad rap, but everything I've seen, that video on the suspicious website I looked at, yeah, it blew up. I didn't get to look at the menu. Um, but I did do research and I know the menu it has. Uh, um, but yeah. It, I, it, weirdest experience, but also a very good experience, because that's awesome. Okay, next thing is the manual. Now, you might think, oh, it's just going to be gibberish. Well, uh, no, actually, it's perfect English. Like, let's see this. Care and precautions. After finish played, be sure to remove the cartridge from slot and unplug AC adapter from wall outlet. And the rest are just like that. Perfect English. Nothing wrong. Anyway, next, the controllers. Yeah, yeah, it's plasticky. Very, very plasticky. Like, original PS1 didn't do that. Anyway, actually, I was surprised. The buttons are pretty good. So if you're wondering, these are plastic with texture. These are flat plastic. And these are rubber soft ones. Um, and there, there's no sticks up here. It's just no, nothing. And yeah, no analog sticks. It's going original PlayStation on you. Um, and just in case, if you didn't know what a D-pad was, they have the arrows right there. Uh, I don't know why they say cyber. No other model of PlayStation has the word cyber there. I, I, I have no clue. And they actually have way more screws than the normal PlayStation has, so... Yeah, nice controllers, actually. The only downside to every, like, the gun and the controllers. What is this? That's it. That is it. You have to sit right in front of this thing to actually use it. <laughs> Which is, I mean, original NES vibes, but still, like, so short. Look at that. Okay, we've done unboxing. Let's plug it in and play some originals. 
Okay, TV's on AV. Poly station plugged in. AV plugged in. Controller set up. All we gotta do is put the CD in. Okay, let's go. Dang, I forgot I had a hinge. I forgot it didn't have a hinge, actually. Okay, come on. Get in there. Get in there. There we go. Yeah, that's how fast it boots. Then that's the boot screen. And yeah, it's so old, it has a hum. Yeah. I love it. It's just up my alley. Okay, it's dark in here because uh, the light reflects on the TV very nicely and it looks beautiful. Yeah, okay, let's, uh, what game first? Let's play, let's just, oh, uh, let's do Road Fighter. Okay, I'll be quiet. It's your gameplay that you wanted. Okay. Oh, did I? Give me that. No. I'm there. I'm there. Okay, I know I said I would be silent. I cannot be silent. Reset. Where's the reset button? There it goes. Oh, so yeah, beautiful reset screen. You don't have to talk about that. Okay. Classic Super Mario Brothers. We gotta do it. Oh my gosh. Oh right, it's Peace Castle too. <laughs> this controller's great by the way, I love it. Like I'm being completely honest here. They ain't the best controllers, but they're like real good. For what for for yeah. Yeah, I know the secrets in this game. And that not being one of them. Shoot. Okay. Hey! Oh, I want those though. Okay, I'll get that in a minute. Okay, come to me. Oh! No, go, go! Okay. Also, uh, because it's a Famicom, I'm probably gonna get a couple cartridges for it. I uh, definitely sight bike for it. Uh, my dad wants Contra, so I might get Contra for it. And uh, I also want Mario 3 on this, because that's also another great game. Oh yeah, 5,000, baby. Oh, yeah, oh, oh, there we go. Sorry, yeah, I really cannot be quiet, guys. I'm a loud person. So this is just, if you want to get to the end and just leave the video, 
You can do that if you want. The rest of the video is just going to be me playing the poly station. Oh, 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 there we go. Hope you guys are liking this uh, premiere so far. Oh, I gotta go back to the music. Yeah! Wait. I, oh, I cannot, I can never do that. Oh, n I need to go back. Okay, I can still do it. Whew! Oh, that was so close. I know there's like a one-up over there or whatever. Go, oh, come on. Oh, wait. No, I can go back. Yeah! No, I kind of... Okay, well, I can't go back in this game. Got him. Oh, whoa! I forgot my bird sleeping. Can't scream. <gasps> oh, oh! Oh, oh! Okay, well, that's Mario. Also, yeah, the reset button's a little funky. I need to uh, put one of the things back in. It came a little broken, but that's fine. Snow Fighter. Oh, let's get a, uh, a, sh a shooter game up. Okay, I got the gun. Also, how the gun works with this is um, you need to have a controller in uh, player one port, and then the gun has to be in player two port. So that's how that works. Let's do uh, da. Where's Duck Hunt? Duck Hunter. Okay, so uh, yeah, it's not gonna work, but it's gonna be fun. Yeah, it just skips the menu, by the way. Got my gun out. It doesn't work, see? It recognizes it, but it doesn't work. I'm shooting right at that bird. Here, I'll try one more time right at the bird. Yeah, no, it doesn't work. Um, but it's fun to pretend. If I have a CRT that has VGA ever, I mean a composite, I will update you with the uh, duck hunt, which it will work. Which it will, it will work, guys. Reset. There we go. Oh, no. I leaned over too far. I'm going to try one. Go back to the menu. There we go. Okay, there we go. Okay, what game next? Oh, so yeah, it only has 10 games on it repeated like a million times. Just so you know. Oh, Tank 2000. Let's try this. Also, sometimes when you reset it, it'll go into this weird menu that's distorted, so you can't tell what it is. It's really weird. I want to know what it is, but it doesn't tell me, because I can't fig even figure it out. Right, you said stage one already. Do I have to push start? I have to push start on that menu? That's kind of weird. Oh, what? You can't go that way. There we go. No, I still... Yeah, I can. Come on. Someone, come here. Oh, oh I'm going to get you first. Yes. Oh, but now this is open. Shoot. Oh, no. He's going to get him. Yeah. Oh, shoot. I'm good at this game. Hey, you come back. Yes. Oh, did I die? Oh, he killed me. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Game over, what? Shoot the gun. Okay, cool. Next game. 
good. Yeah. Oh, it did it for you. The secret menu. I pushed reset. What the heck is this? Someone tell me what this is. <gasps> Wait, what if I push start on it? <gasps> what the heck? Is it shooting it? No, what? I can't even. The sprite's not there. I can see game over. Or something. Oh, wait. No, I see the sprite moving. What? See it jumping? That's me. Dude. Wait, wait, wait. Put the camera down. I, I actually want to try to play this game. Dude, I just clicked reset. That's so funny that it happened. And I just talked about it. I'm gonna play this game, okay guys. Also, why is B jump, like? Look at this, this is so weird, dude. Oh, there's something there. Oh, what was that? That was like a spike trap or something. What does it say? I see A-M-E, I thought it said game over, but I'm guessing not now. Jump over, whatever the heck that is. What? I don't, see, that looks like some, oh yeah, it is something. Dude, I'm so confused right now. What is that? Oh, I made past it. What was that? Oh, wait, you know what? Guys, this is Pokemon. I've played the game on this system before that says Pokemon. And I know that it's water and the block is there and there's trees. At okay. But I don't know what these are. Like, that's weird. Okay. So this is just really screwed up Pokemon, guys. Here. Yeah. Oh, these are the bouncy guy. Yeah, this is to I totally know what this is. I, I just said, it's yep, there's the little thing that you try to get when you do that. Yeah, this is just Pokemon. No! Yeah. Oh, I don't remember this. This is weird. Whoa. Oh my god. Seizure warning, guys. This. I can't play. Start. Okay, there we go. It's the same board. See, you can see the little health counter up there that's like not working, obviously. Here, guys, memorize this, okay? Memorize what this looks like. And then, okay. Okay, stop. Ready? I'm gonna stand in the same place in the Pokemon game, okay? Watch, I'm gonna run over this. Yeah, shut it. Right? Memorize this area, okay? And now look, the actual proper game, I'm telling you. And look at the grass and everything. See, these are mushrooms. The bouncy things were mushrooms. See, and then that thing you wanna collect? See? And the soundtrack and see the Pokemon up there? And then if I die, see, I just died. See, the tree, that's what it was trying to display in the ground and everything. And it didn't actually pick up him, but those were the spikes that I fell in before, and then that's the ro that was, I guess it was a rock. But, and then you go right here and you're at it. Yeah, I, I don't know how I memorized that from like two days ago when I booted this up to check that it worked. But I, yeah, I guess I just did. That's insane that I memorized that, but I, I knew it. But that doesn't makes sense why it would sometimes boot into a glitched Pokemon, though. That still has no reason why it sometimes does that when you push reset. Like, watch. Ready? Ready? I'm about to push reset. Okay, it worked this time. But you you saw it did it before. Anyway. Okay, one more game, and then uh, I think we'll call it a video. Clay Shooting. That's another game one. Or, no, I don't know. Snow fighter? Future kid.
The heck is feet? Oh no, what is this? What is this? What is this? I have to hit things? Oh no, this looks so bad. <laughs> what is this? I just have to hit every target in front of me? But I can't reach some. Wait, is this just the fish game where I like eat smaller ones and then you can eat the bigger ones? That's exactly what this is, guys. This is just, oh, such a strange version of that game, I think. Because that looks like a jellyfish, does it not? Okay. I, maybe not. Reset. There we go. Again, it worked this time. Ju oh, Jewel Tetris is actually just Tetris, guys. It's actually a very cool version. Uh, look, Silence is that one. Oh, I wish I had a capture card, because I would record all of these songs and make them into music. I would totally do that, because these are dope. Oh yeah, let's go do that. I'm not good at Tetris, by the way, guys. Wait, maybe I am. Wait, no way, I already got a row. I've never done this before. Oh, I've never been this good at Tetris before. What the heck? No way. No way! No way! I am doing so good right now. Well, that... Oh, no way. It's giving it to me. I swear, guys. I've always put it on easy. I can never do this. I don't know what to do with this. There. Okay, cool. Uh... And this is where I fail. Yup. Now it's trying to screw me up. Oh, I may get the last row though. Nope, nope, don't put it there. Put it there. Yes! Single, I thought it was double. Oh no, because I made a hole there. What the heck? I've never done this good in Tetris. No. Ah! Ah! Wait, no, it can do this. Right in there. How did I get that one? No way. Oh, no, yeah, no way. No way! Why am I doing so good right now? way can someone tell me why i'm doing so good when the camera's on double no way i've never gotten a double in my life wait there or there i want to go here opportunity oh my gosh Why is the game giving it to me? Oh no. <gasps> no, it's gonna give it to me. Double right now. Oh no, single. No, oh, double! Why am I doing so well right now? Dude, I, I always have to film when I play Tetris now. Cause that's when I win, I guess. Uh oh, wait. No, that'll just go. Uh oh. Oh, shoot. Stop giving me these. Uh-oh. Oh! Okay, I got one row there. Oh, that... Okay. Yeah, these controllers are actually pretty good. I'm very surprised with the quality of this. I thought it was gonna be, like... Um... What the heck? Dude, I always need to record when I play Tetris now. Why did I just get 20 points for that? 
Can someone tell me why I just got 20 points for nothing? Maybe it wasn't nothing. Why am I getting points? Like, on points, on points. Dude! I swear, this has never happened in the world of anyone, anywhere. Ah! Oh. Okay, sure. I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take that. I screwed up. Ah! Oh. I don't know. Oh, and this is where I fail, guys. No! <gasps> no! What? I always have to record when I'm playing Tetris now. Oh! Oh! No! Yes! Yeah! Ah! Ah! Oh! That was such a good round, though! Oh, man. Okay. Oh, I thought it was gonna go in uh, glitchy Pokemon. Glitchy Mon again. Um, what's clay shooting? Oh. Uh, this is a gun game, I can see. Ah! Oh, I missed. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, wait, actually, in this game, something really weird happened. I actually got a, I actually got one of these discs once. And I'm like, how the heck? Anyway, I think that's enough gaming for now. Um, oh, it's still zoomed in. If you guys liked, uh, shush. If you guys like the, uh, Polystation gaming, I could do more of that. I'm down for gaming videos. More of those, because this is really fun. <laughs> Gotta get the disc out. Um, yeah, this is really fun playing this thing, actually. Uh, worth every penny, honestly. This thing is amazing. I love it so much. Um, better than expected, too, actually. I know that sounds weird, but I, I, I just have a sweet spot in my heart for Fami clones. I do. They're so precious and perfect and plasticky. <laughs> Uh, okay, there goes the plug. Yeah, as you saw, it turned on, and it was gaming. Heavy gaming. But, uh, yeah, I, as I said, I will get some uh, cartridges for this guy in the future. Because, you know, it's actually, a, it's a real capable machine. That's so weird, because it was actually, like, time correct. Well, I guess the Famicom came out way before this. Well, not way, but still, like, this is a pretty early Famiclone. Uh, if you're going to be honest, like, it was at least before 2000, obviously. <laughs> I mean, why would you make a product for that says Y2K on it after Y2K? Um, it's an 8-bit CPU. If you guys wonder, there's the model if you ever want to try to find one. You're probably not going to be able to, though. It's 9 volts and 500 mi Wow, not even one amp. Half an amp this thing takes. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Hmm. Good times at the Poly Station, and I will be playing more. I could do a lot. Uh, I could do more premieres of uh, gaming on this if you guys want. I don't know if you want that, but I can do it for you guys if you like it. Um. Anyway, um, like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.